So this is Josh Hart from JTH Boxing and today I'm joined by victorious Ezra Taylor. Ezra, first of all, how are we doing? I'm good man, I'm good. I just done my first eight rounder. Um, I feel like it went well, could have done better. But I'm always going to say that to be honest, even if I knocked him out and done whatever, I still feel like I can do more, you know. Um, there's never, there's no such thing as a perfect performance, but I'm trying to work to get something close to that, you know. But yeah, I'm happy man. I got the W, what more can I uh, complain about? He was a very tough opponent. I wasn't able to catch all the fight, but when I came down, I could see his eye was an absolute mess. His eye looked horrible. Can you just summarise the fight, please? Um, it was good, man. I had to be very uh, strategic with what I was doing. As you said, he was tough. If I got out there, guns blazing, yeah, I'm going to run out of ammo. You know what I'm saying? So I just had to just pick my shots, stay on my jab, use my feints, use my levels, my range, my power, defence, offence. I felt like I showed an array of skills in there. Um, and it's a lot for me to go and take back. You know, if I, like I said, if I stopped him in like the first or second round, there's not, there's not much for me to work on. But I'm happy that I've got things to work on um, because I really want to become the best. So, so yeah, I'm happy with the performance. Um, I'm waiting to get back and my team's going to get me, give me a grilling because I know I did a lot of things that I shouldn't have. But it was fun, man. This boxing game is a serious game, but you meant to go in there and enjoy it. And I feel like, I, it's not even I feel like, I enjoyed it in there. You know, them eight rounds, every second of that I enjoyed. So, so yeah, man, I'm a happy man. He looks very slick and sharp there, even towards the end of the eighth round. You know, you still looked very sharp, you know, dodging, weaving. How was the camp preparing for this fight? The camp, brilliant, man, brilliant. I've been in there with some serious hitters. I've been, I've been working hard, um, and that's why I was able to, you know, still show the sharpness, you know, the speed, the mentality of um, being a, a world-class fighter because I had to stay on my mentality. Man, you know, when you get tired, your mind starts switching off, but you, you can't switch off in that ring. So I feel like I was switched on all the time. Got caught with a few shots, but it's boxing, you know, so I'm not going to be upset with that. I got the W, I did damage. I'm happy with it, man. And you just adding to Nottingham's amazing form at the moment. Being from Nottingham myself, it's brilliant to see. Lee Wood getting his world title back. Echo Esmond's on flying form. Derek Asase is getting back. How good is it just to add to that Nottingham fighting spirit? It's brilliant, man. It's brilliant. It's, it's amazing. It's amazing. I come from a small shack, man, Bilbo Boxing Club. It's a shed. It's no bigger than this room. And I'm here, you know, I'm fighting on, uh, on live TV. I'm blessed to be on a, a good platform with Frank Warren. He's putting me out there, you know, we're stepping up. And I'm able to rub shoulders with people, the likes of Lee Wood, Eka Esserman, you know. We've got all the people around working, you know, putting in. It's 2023, man. Nottingham's back on the scene fully. I know Carl Fox is flying the flag, but now I've got it with two hands swinging it. So, yeah, man, I'm, I'm enjoying the journey, as you can probably see. Um, but, yeah, we've got talent. Nottingham's got talent, man. <laughs> so is the dream to headline at the arena or, you know, even do what Lee Wood wants to do, headline at the stadium? Is that just a dream, just to bring boxing back to Nottingham as well? Yeah, the dream anywhere, man. Just anywhere in Nottingham. I want my, I want, I want my people to be able to witness what I've been working so hard for. I know you can watch me on TV, but it's not... It's nothing, it's nothing like having your people behind you, you know. Today I had quite a few people, you know, supporting me and just hearing the cheers and just the atmosphere. When people in there and they're saying that, yeah, the crowd gives you energy, I felt it, man. And it's, it's, it's an amazing feeling. So, yeah, Nottingham, where else? Where, wherever, wherever, man. Like, world title, MGM Grand, wherever it may be, I just want to keep cracking on. But, yeah, for sure, before my career ends, definitely to get something at Nottingham, man. We'll do it in a car park if we need to. Now, there's a lot of noise going on back there between Liam Davies and Jason Cunningham. No, no. But I just want to say, walking about tonight, I've seen a lot of people walking around in these Ezra Taylor tracksuits. Where, where can I get my hands on one of those? Oh, man, I got you, man. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. I'm not going to give you the secret of where you can get it from, but I'm going to get you one for sure, man. You're not an born and bred, so it's only right. I've got you, man. I've got you. Yeah, so finally, just a message to all the people who have come out to support you tonight. Like I said, I've seen a lot of people out there tonight. Just a quick message to them. I appreciate every every bit of support, man. Maybe through the social media, through if you just if you just see me now and you're a fan, I appreciate all the support, man. It doesn't go unnoticed. I acknowledge it all. Thank you to all my sponsors, uh, Global Clothing Solutions, London Needs Calling, uh, GD Civils, Senator, everyone who's supported me, Michael Costa, Snoop. I could be reading off fair names right now, but I'm gonna keep it calm. I just I just 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 know that I'm very very grateful for all support, man. These guys are kicking off over here, man. But that's energy right now, and I like it. We're sharing the same energy, you know. Fighters want to fight. Um, and this is what, it's in six weeks' time, right? Telford. I've been in, I've been in Telford a few times, man. That's coming like my home as well. Uh, but, yeah, you know, who, who knows? Ezra Taylor's active. I'm here. So, we'll see, man. Hopefully, you'll see more of me. One thing I actually forgot to talk about was Willie Hutchinson. I know you've been talking about his name a lot. Just a quick message to Willie Hutchinson. Hey, Willie Hutchinson, man. Stay on your P's and Q's. I'm the Japanese bullet train, man. I'll really run through you, you little boy. As well, pleasure to talk to you, holding the Nottingham flag, flying it high. Congratulations. Thank you, man. I appreciate your time.